All right, so here's another detail. Just don't want to fall off the catwalk here. But notice we have a whole series of reinforcing bars that run down the wall. They come in, you can see how it comes in there, and then it gets tied to a bar that goes across here that's about 18 inches. And so what's going to happen here is, and like I said, you notice that they're all perfectly aligned there. Well, this is where our garage wall will come and eventually intersect. And you can see if we go down here, you can see the bars down the other side sticking out right there. And um, so that's how we tie the garage wall into this wall. So right here is the center of the wall pretty much. And then what will happen is they'll just carve out eight inches of foam here. And then the concrete from the new garage foundation wall will butt right up to the inside face of the concrete here or exterior face of the concrete there. And then that'll tie up here into our new garage wall. So the other thing we got going on here is, you know, proper planning. We got one of our utility pipes already planned for. You can see it zips right through. And then it's already foam sealed here. So knowing the placement of all these utilities allows us to put those in and then simply pour the concrete around them. All right, let's go look at another detail.